Kev, uh, what did you make of today's performance then? I mean, can you believe that you're in the last 32? I mean, what an achievement uh, beating National League Wildstone here today. It, it was special. It was a special day. Big crowd, obviously, they bought, bought a fair few themselves. But um, I don't want to sound arrogant. <laughs> I knew it was possible for us to get a result. Um, I've been saying it all season that we've, we've played well in games and not got what we deserved. And when we play well, we can, we're capable of beating anyone, uh, albeit two leagues above us. So it's not a shock to me. Um, it's still very, very pleasing. And, and I'm buzzing for the lads. I said to them at half time, look, whatever happens, you stick together. I just wanted them to come out and show how good they can be individually and collectively. And, and I said it to them, and, and I meant it. I said every single player I've got in there could play at. Willstone's level. I haven't got a doubt in my mind about that. Um, and people will say you're, you're deluded and, and biased. I'm not. Um, I know what it takes to play at that level and above, and, and I know I've got lads that can. Um, so I'm just pleased they went out and, and, and put on a performance. I thought first half we were, were dominant, um, got two goals up, and, and possibly with, with better decision making, final third could have been more. Um, they was always going to have a spell, and it got edgy, and Marco's made saves. I'm just buzzing for the lads because it has been a, a tough start to the season for us. We are starting to pick up, but days like this are special and um, it was billed as the biggest game in the club's history, which is great. Um, there's now enough. You certainly turned up, didn't you, that first half? I mean, it was the it was the perfect start. You'd said to me it weren't going to be a conservative approach. You wanted to be front foot, aggressive. They certainly delivered that for I, you. I, th I think it's really important. I think that's when we're at our best, when we're front foot and aggressive and and, and when we become passive like we did second half, which is, is, is natural, you're trying to hold on to what you've got, we're not particularly good at it. Um, although we, we see it out today with a little bit of luck and, and, like I say, good defending at times and good saves. I just wanted us to be aggressive and, and go and impose ourselves on the game and do what we do best. Um, because I knew that that would give us a chance, which which it has. It was some finish from Luke Ingram, wasn't it, when he uh, he got through and and just chipped the goalkeeper beautifully. Yeah, look, obviously the first one the goalkeeper is going to be disappointed with, but it gave us a leg up, and, and Luke's been brilliant. He, he's not a centre forward. I've asked him to play there. Um, obviously, with shortage of strikers, we've also got good young strikers that are coming through, but Luke's been big and magnificent. He holds the ball up, he gives us a vocal point, and he scored some real big goals, none bigger than the one today. It was, it was a it's sublime finish. Yeah, and um, I mean, it was quite a youthful side still with like academy roots kind of shining through, and uh, Scott Fitzgerald came into the starting lineup and uh, put in a great performance. Yeah, well, look, this is what this club's about. We're, we're a progressive club we want to move forward we've got an unbelievable academy unbelievable facilities unbelievable people involved at the football club um, and the future's bright we've got good kids I've, I've brought Taylor Clark on 17 first year scholar coming on to the game Fitzy you've mentioned you've got Noah Jake the list goes on Kieran we, we, we will hopefully one day be, be nearly a, a squad full of players that we've produced ourselves we've got good coaches that, that teach them the right way so um, I, I'm just proud to be, be manager of this club and feel very privileged and just a final one, uh, what do you want from Monday's draw then? Any any cliche, special requests? Not really, cliche. Um, a home draw would obviously yep. be really nice. Hopefully another bumper crowd or one of the big boys away. Four wins from Wembley. Sounds Enjoy good. it. Sounds good, thank you.